Hello everyone. Today I'll be reading John 14 and 27 in the Amplified Version. And first I want to say I thank everyone for um, for tuning in today. I uh, pray that it's blessed, this um, Bible verse blesses you. It's um, one that touches my heart. And right now it's ministering to me where I'm at in my season. So I pray that also blesses you. John 14 and 27. Peace I leave with you. My perfect peace I give to you. Not as the world gives do I give to you. Do not let your heart be troubled, nor let it be afraid. Let my perfect peace calm you in every circumstance and give you courage and strength for every challenge. Allow this word to weave into your spirit. It's there already. Just allow it to grow into your um, spirit today. I pray this, um, this word blesses you. This word right now, to me, it means um, just take courage. Take courage in what God's doing in your life. Um, do not let your heart be troubled. Don't let your heart ache for another person, for a place, for a thing, for a job, for a car. Just let your heart be um, free to love. Free to love yourself and free to love others. Also, it says in here, um, my perfect peace I give to you. Not as the world gives do I give to you. Peace with way within peace that it could be a storm around you and you could just have the peace of God within you in your spirit and resting in him knowing that your mind is clear and you can just rest in him no matter what your circumstances are be it debt um, bad marriage bad relationships um, a job that you don't care for just know the peace of God rests in you every day and all day we walk in peace every day we wear, we wear the shoes of peace also takes courage and strength for every challenge no matter what challenge you're going through in life, um, on your job, or whatever challenge that you have in your life, um, I pray that today our minds shift and we let this word um, grow in us. And as we walk into our peace, our strength, our courage, and know that God is in control. It's God's blessing that he has for our life. God wants us to do different things in our lives. He wants us to fulfill different things for him. So once we let go and just free ourselves of all of our, of our agenda, of our plans, of what we consider our destiny, what we want to do, and it's about what God wants us to do as we walk this earth. So keep in mind that once we let go freely, let go every day, know that our steps are ordered by the Lord. Every step that we take is getting us closer to Him and fulfilling His will that He has over our life, what He wants us to do on earth, and just know that He's with us every step. Now what we're going through, um, you could be um, addicted to drugs, alcohol, you could have a spirit of lust, you could be doing um, at nighttime um, and tampering, tampering with um, pornography, gambling, um, gluttony, eating a lot, whatever your circumstances are, whatever you're going through in life, know that God has your hand, he has his hand inside, our hands are inside of his, it's his hand, and he's holding us tightly throughout the night and throughout the day, and he's guiding us, he's shielding us from all harm, hurt, harm, or danger, he has our back, know that God is with us every step of the way, I pray his message blesses you and lets you know that I love you, I'm praying for everyone, have an awesome and blessed day in Jesus Christ, amen.